Welcome back to Progress EDC. Got a little CRKT today, the pillar. I went ahead and uh, picked this one up. I, I want to say it was under 30 bucks. And got the stainless steel and the copper. I've been carrying it a little bit. And got a little patina going because the whole point of this one is I was going to left, left pocket carry it and uh, keep it around as a beater and try to get some natural work patina going on it. Plus, I haven't messed with the, uh, the CRKT much, so I figured a little, you know, something like a backup or something like that. Blade shape looked pretty good to me. So, let y'all soak that up there. And we're looking at 8CR13 MOV sheep's foot with a satin finish. And that big old blade is just under two and a half inches, 2.40, uh, 0.15 on the thickness, nice flat grind on that satin plain edge finish. Handle length, three and a half inches. And it comes in at right at four ounces. So it's pretty light, somewhat light, you know, small carry. Uh, frame locking stainless on the other side. And the pillar, which is a Jesper, Jesper <clears throat> Vonox. And the pillar is named after Ernest Hemingway's beloved sailboat. Yeah. Interesting one there. Interesting. Reversible tip down carry. I mean, you can tip down or tip up carry this. You're not gonna flip it to the other side, but you're gonna flip up and down. So, a little bit of versatility, but nothing crazy. Little backspacer action there. She's off center just a hair. $30, folks. And that action, I don't know if it's the size of the knife or what, but I mean, I, I really got to decide if I'm going to flick it. Let's see if I can get the uh, thumb here. Nope. And I'm going to end up cutting my damn thumb if I don't play with it too much because, I mean, it, it's got a pretty good edge on it. It's a small little backup knife. Kind of a work blade is what I, what I bought it for. I mean, at 30 bucks cannot really go wrong on it and <clears throat> I looked it at it so that and I went with this one because I there's a little bit of a, a deal where you can you know take this thing and make it yours I mean you, you know you, there's uh, some carbon fiber scale kits, uh, titanium. I went ahead and started with the copper. Uh, you know, Flytanium's making scales for it. You can flip out the back spacers. So there's a lot of uh, make this your own you know, and, and customize it in that. And that was kind of why I went with it. I was going to let some patina get on this and then, you know, hey, <coughs> maybe I'll throw something, uh, throw something different on it, you know, and, and just kind of, that way you're out, 
you know, 20, 30 bucks for the knife and then, you know, buy you a couple of flytanium uh, scales and <clears throat> off you go, you know, changing colors to, to match whatever whatever you're floating. I mean, that's, I, I was on Etsy is where I went and looked, uh, looked at them. I mean, there's some, some pretty good looking scales on there. I, I mean, you're, for some of the really jazzed up, uh, multi-colored ones, you're going to be out, you know, 40 bucks. But, you know, I mean, to make it yours and uh, I think this one the, the one I was looking at G Carta white G10 and, and it's got you know some real color to it uh, damn picture won't load it's like a black and, and blue wave on top of uh, the white G10 and I mean it it's got a good <laughs> <clears throat> good look to it. Damn. I'm not editing it out. You can get, you know, it's a small knife, so you're going to have to choke up on it. And it's got a generous finger choil. No jimping on top, but plenty of, you know, smooth rest for your thumb to get in there and, and do some good cuts. It's a... Uh, it's a pretty standard little uh, little utilitarian type knife. It's gonna have a good solid lock up. You can see that. She's locked up good and solid. So, lanyard hole. I think it's a solid small carry. Not really, you know, the, the biggest thing that drove me on this one was, you know, being able to possibly add some, some scales and some flair to it without, you know, because that, that's always a, I mean, that's a good time, you know, throw out a different scale on it and you get tired of the copper and you're like, eh. And throw something else on it for a minute. Get a little bit more life out of it. Pretty much short and sweet on that one. Uh, it's the uh, it's one of the first CRKTs. I, I, I've not really messed with them much. I've had a couple of the fixed blades, but so far, man, I'm 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 pretty fond of it. I like the little blade shape. It's been useful and. Uh, We'll see. I'll continue to carry it here and there and, and throw it out there. But CRKT, pillar. Another one of them little budget bang outs, man. It's definitely something to pick up. Uh, White Mountain has them pretty cheap right now. Uh, snatch one up and add it to the collection. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Drop a comment. Man, I appreciate those. Stay sharp. Stay safe.